So I'm just gonna show you guys the area where I'm staying at. This is in between the CBD and the garden section. It's a nice day today, sunny, a little bit of a breeze. It's about 79, 80 degrees, give or take. Okay, we got the African market here. Smelling good. Might have to check that one out. So at this point I had to cut the video because I got confronted by some of the street prostitutes that were operating in broad daylight. They had a problem with me filming. Now I wasn't even aware that there were prostitutes in this area on Long Street operating in daylight hours, but it is what it is. You know, you live and you learn. So they didn't like me filming. I'm just minding my business. I'm not filming faces like that, but it turned into something. That's all I could say. So hit that like button. I'm putting in work out here. I swear to y'all, I'm putting in work. And uh, just stay tuned. So I got the strawberry cheesecake with chocolate chip cookies on the outside. Thank you. All right. Thank you. All right. So I got my crumbs and cream ice cream sandwich. This is what it looks like. And I'll show you guys how it tastes here in a minute. So this ice cream and cookie are very good. The ice cream is on point. The cookie is nice and soft. So it goes together really well. So guys, we're here at Sunset Beach. At the right time, we caught the sunset. It's really perfect timing. I just happened to be here. Get a load of that view. It's one of a kind. And so this beach is only located about 20 minute drive from the downtown. So this is what you see in the parks here in Cape Town, Duck Dynasty. It's 
so many ducks. He's looking at me like, yo, you're on my home. You know where you are right now? We 20 deep. You all alone. This is duck town. That's how he's looking at me. But I ain't even mad at him. You know, I gotta respect his duck gangster. Cause he's not backing down. He's like, yeah, we run this. This is our territory. And this dude, he's stalking me, look. This dude, he's stalking me, he's trying to punk me. He's trying to get me to leave. He's like, yeah, yeah, right. So that's just what it looks like. I'm actually like only one or two blocks away from Long Street. And this is a very nice park, it's chill. I don't know what it's like after dark, but during the daytime, lots of folks in here, some people selling things, some people just chilling on the park benches. And it'll get you out of the heat of the sun. It'll get you out of the wind because you have these really big trees like this one here behind me. And these give you some kind of protection because if y'all don't know, the winds out here, nothing to mess around with. Gotta be seen to be believed. Unless you're from Chicago, then you probably already know. But everybody else, you gotta come out here and really experience it. This is different. So here we are, we're at the beach in Musenberg, Moisenberg, however you pronounce it. I'm not entirely sure, but I'm at the shore. So this is my first time over this way. This is a famous surfing beach. So you got a lot of people out here with their boards, a lot of surf schools set up. It's a very different vibe from some of the other beaches that I've been to here in Cape Town. I'm going to show you guys a little bit of how things look. So this wind is still extremely cold, just like everywhere else in the city. But I've been told that the water, instead of just being freezing cold, is just extremely cold. So. I'm gonna put my feet in here for a second and confirm or deny if that is the case. So just bear with me. Let's see how cold it is. It can't be that cold because there's a lot more people in the water than anywhere else I've been. So here goes nothing. Here we go, here we go. Alright, it's still freaking cold, but it's it's tolerable, right? Let me go at least into my ankle 
so I can really judge for y'all. Okay, it's cold, but it's not like you're getting electrocuted cold. Because where I was before, on the Western Cape, it was like I was being electrocuted. I could not even hold my feet in the water for more than like three seconds. So yeah, I could deal with this. Especially on a day like today where it's really hot. That's actually getting later. So right now it's about 5.30. It's here. I think they're here just for pictures, for the, the culture and the tourism aspect. Okay, so my food just arrived. I got the prawns and the rice. Just the okay, just the perfect. All right, so they give me this basket here. This bucket that I can put the the prawns, the shells inside. Rice is fresh. You can see the steam maybe coming up off of it. So you know everything has just been prepared for me. We're actually right down the street from the coast, from the beach here. So it's very convenient. If you need some protein, you need some carbs after you're done surfing or whatever you do. Focus, man.